Okay, so in this lab, we are going to be making measurements and reporting them using the correct number of significant figures. So we're going to be using two instruments to measure volume, a graduated cylinder and a beaker, and then two different balances to measure mass. This one is a centigram balance, so it measures to the nearest centigram. This one is a milligram balance, so it measures to the nearest milligram. And then there are some rulers on your Google Doc that you will be using to measure length. So let's start with our volume measurements. We are going to measure the volume of this crucible. This thing's called a crucible, a little cup, um, and this glass vial. So we want to just figure out how much liquid they will hold. So I'm going to fill up this crucible with liquid. And first, I'm going to pour it into the cylinder. And then I'm going to hold up my phone to the cylinder so we can measure it. Okay, so what I want you to do is report that measurement using the correct number of significant figures. So hopefully you can see that. You can see there's a line down here that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So that's what the lines are. Okay, now we're gonna measure that same crucible, but this time with the beaker. So again, I'm gonna fill up the crucible. I'll bring my phone down here so you can read the volume. So there is the beaker. So record that using the correct number of significant figures. Okay, now we're gonna do the volume of this little vial over here. So I'm actually gonna pour into it um, from the beaker. Okay, so there's my little glass vial. Let's first measure its volume in the graduated cylinder. Okay. So, it's kind of hard to see. Um, there's a line right underneath it, right underneath the liquid level, that would be the line for five milliliters right here. So it's that line right there, that is the six line that it's right underneath. So six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sorry, it's kind of hard to see on this cylinder. Okay, and then we're gonna measure that same volume in the beaker. So I'll just pour it into the beaker. And you're gonna do your best to report that measurement with the correct number of significant figures. Okay, so those are our volume measurements. Now we're gonna do our mass measurements. So I'm gonna pull the scales over here. Okay, so first we're going to measure a penny. So there's a penny on the centigram balance. And then here is the penny on the milligram balance. That says 2.504, if you can't read it. Okay. Um, now we're gonna measure a pen. So there's the pen on the centigram balance. And there's the pen on the milligram balance that says 10.515. Okay, and then the other measurements are just using those rulers um, on the Google Doc. So that's, I think, all you need the video for. Good luck.